Hey y'all, what's going on? This is Nisha, Mrs. Valtero's back to do another daily. What you say, boo? Hey y'all, welcome back. This is Mrs. Wild Wild Hearts, Wild Hearts. Check out that membership, join the membership. Okay. If you like to book a personal reading with me, check out simplybookme.com or go to my website at misswildturtles.com where you can book with me. Okay. We're going to be doing Aries to Pisces in that order. Okay. I was like looking at it and it says, okay, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification button. <laughs> all right. So anyways. Oh, yeah. Check out all my um, information below. My Amazon wish list, my PayPal, my Cash App if you like to donate. All right. So, Aries, who's coming towards you? Let's go. The output or what's coming towards you, what you need to know. The six, uh, the seven of crystal. All right. So, this say option and results. So, this is like the seven of pentacles. Okay. So, it could be a Taurus. Yeah. So, I feel like you're going to get some type of results on today uh, with something you've been putting out. I'll put we got here six of the transition and insight that's coming towards you guys all right so this could be uh aquarius also you guys are traveling moving relocating as well is what i'm seeing we got here the empress okay so beauty and abundance is also coming towards you guys so i'm seeing here with the beauty and abundance with three it's about your creativity okay somebody may learn somebody's also pregnant could be a libra or taurus that you're dealing with okay so something you've been investing in you could have been putting time into your beauty or you could have been putting time into building a beauty project or something with your interior design and you finally like enjoy or like the results of something today aries all right so we have here the page of acorn all right so discovery and enthusiasm all right, so I feel like it's a fire sign. Maybe even your kid or somebody's coming to you with a bright ideal, but you got good news coming in with the page of ones. All right, are you going to discover something today? Two of feathers, two of swords. Okay, decision and direction. So um, you have to make a choice about this Libra relationship as well. And you could be also dealt with somebody who's trying to give you some competition or something. Ten of shells. And we got here blessings and well-being. So today is a day of blessings. Are you going to feel blessed as well? Or you could be blessing somebody as well. Let's see. We got the boot and we got the rat. And the tat, tat, tat. We got indecisive. Okay, what did it say? Increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goal. So you could be telling somebody you're going to have to work a whole lot harder than that. <laughs> the boot. We got the rat. Hey, welcome. Good morning, Miss Griffin. Uh, someone's working against you behind your back, okay? Um, so, yeah, be aware of that. Um, I feel like somebody's trying to slow you down, somebody purposely making a bad decision or trying to make it seem like you made a terrible decision. It could be a mother with the Tour Source and Empress Libra Taurus energy. Something about your money and how you work with your money. February, okay? Somebody could be more smoke up your ass, okay? We got ill health, okay? So take care of yourself, your body, or somebody could be dealing with some mental illness, a period of ill health and dep um, depression. And we got a teapot. All right, so we'll sell some tea here. I got that fly. Okay, a fly on a wall, super fly. Okay, somebody on some bullshit. Um, but deep, deep friendship with the same sex. Okay, so you can begin together with your um, best friend talking about this, discovering this, or you might discover somebody was sick or not doing too well. Um, let's see. Or somebody will try to make you sick or something or seafood or somebody has a larger reaction to something they eat today be careful of that as well i'm getting that too with the seashells ten of cups is pisces energy too family what's the advice for you aries moderation okay and manifestation at the bottom all right, so candles, okay, purple candles seem like amethyst, okay, spirituality, moderation, um, setting up healthy boundaries with people as well. And so I say, is there something that you know you shouldn't be eating? Try a um, try to eat mindfully, healthily, although the fairies say a little bit of what you fancy is fine. So yeah, so, you know, somebody's trying to get on you about what you eat, how you eat, what you're eating, okay. Let's go. This could be your wife, your spouse, too. For some of y'all, they want to, they have concerns about your health. Taurus, what's going on with you today? What can you expect? Talking to the moon. Mm. You could be talking to a Pisces or a Cancer, talking to the moon. <laughs> 
right, let's see what's going on. Okay, so somebody could be sending you a playlist. Are you putting your playlist together? Uh, Taurus, let's see what's going on. All right, we got here the six of acorn. There you go. The six of one, so success and trumpet. It could be a Leo coming towards you. Yes, a yes coming towards you. Seven of shells. Okay, choice and ambition. So I feel like you're choosing to go after something that's your dreams as well. All right, leading the way. We got here the three of acorn, looking forward to the future, or you see something manifesting right in front of you. Okay. Foresight and exploration, okay? Um, you could be going on an adventure. I heard field trip for some of you guys. All right, discovering something new. Um, what are the people that be discovering new fossils and stuff like that? I feel like somebody's digging in the dirt or digging up dirt and shit. <laughs> you guys may be like gardening today, okay? Or you may want to start to learn how to garden. And we got here nine of crystals, okay, security and abundance. So it could be a Virgo coming out of the blue one to talk to you guys, discussing putting money into some type of project. But we have here six, seven, eight. <laughs> we got here two of acorn, okay. So I feel like um, insight and focus, okay, two of ones. You could be focusing on your prey or focusing on what you want to eat, or you could be like catching something today. Mm hmm. Catch a tiger by his toe, any mini, mighty mo, and I pick you. All right. So it could be like a, a, a Leo, Aries, a Sagittarius. Okay. Somebody's looking at you. I right, encourage and commitment. Okay. <laughs> Do -do -do -do. Drum rolls. Okay. <laughs> I need to get on here that one thing when they be TV, like tick, 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 boom. We got, okay, arrow. You are on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. Okay. So. Um, you are being shown the way, or you guys are you doing really well. We have here. What's this? Haystack. Okay, karma. You will reap what you sow. All right. So you sow good seeds, you get good seeds. You sow bad seeds, you get bad seeds. Okay. We got the bowl. Plenty of material things. Okay. So eating good. Okay. Feeling good. And we got cobweb for you towards today. All right. It got here protection from uh negative forces that's beyond your control okay so if somebody was trying to set a trap up seven of cups confuse you you're protected from that as well as what i'm seeing um uh, yeah definitely with that nine of pinnacle so i feel like you either protected something or you got your own little trap set up here all right or you catching like you know boo trap okay so um I know sometimes, like, depending on if you got, like, certain technology or phone, you can set up, like, certain things. Like, if somebody would ever get your phone, that everything erases, okay? So, maybe y'all got something like that set in place where if someone was able to crack your codes, that it just erase everything. All right, we have here fine balance, okay? So, it's something about studying, okay? But yeah, definitely a protection spells with the crystal and the book in her hand, Okay. So I feel like they want you to confirm that your protections are working, okay, or your and prayers are being ans answered if you, like, um, protect you from your enemies, okay? Find balance between your work, rest, and play time. You will have more energy and harmony and productivity in your life. Take a power nap, okay? So they want you to get some rest, Taurus, okay? Or you might find yourself taking more naps or feeling less uh, kind of drained and stuff. And so that's a signal from your body to take a break. All right, so Gemini Tempest, okay? So you're learning something about a Sagittarius that they're not going to change, or a Sagittarius realizing you are who you are with the zebra never changes, right? All right, I'm getting that right now, okay? So something seems to be peaceful, or someone wants to reconcile with you. Are you, are you losing your balance, your peace of mind today, okay? We got here the Ten of Pentacles. Wow, you guys had the Ten of Pentacles um, today. So it's definitely money that's forecasting for you guys. The eight of crystal coat, eight of crystal coast, crystal cola. <laughs> I hope y'all ain't selling no weight, no drugs, or nothing like that. Okay, it's a lot of money, ten p's, ten kilos, or something. But anyway, that's another story. But we got here eight of pentacles, ten of pentacles. I'm gonna keep it like um to the money, but stability and attainment, dedication and progress. So, hello, one of a kind. Welcome, love. So money coming in here, crocodiles is like uh, related. So anyways, I'm getting somebody thought you was like a dinosaur. Somebody thought you was older. Some of y'all, somebody here, um, they didn't, um, they underestimated your regeneration and stuff, okay? <laughs> they they underestimated your regeneration power, okay? Or your ability to lock in on the target, okay? 
I don't know if this is a crocodile alligator, but anyway, it looks like a croc, okay? <laughs> so are y'all gatoring me and honey, okay? Or are y'all hunters, okay? I feel like um, hunting will get you a lot of money here too. Yeah, let me see what else I'm pulling from that. We got here, love. Okay, there y'all go, Gemini. All right, choice and trust, okay? And the wolf pack. We got here the tower, okay? The benefit is y'all release and revelation, okay? Yeah, <laughs> most definitely. So y'all could be getting a revelation about how, how to make money or how to get rich quick, okay? With that 10 of Pentacles and that tower. We got here eight of shells, okay? Quest and renewal. Yeah, so you guys are coming back or feeling good. It's also somebody that abandoned you. All right, star seeds. Some of you guys are star seeds, rainbow child or crystals, okay? Um, Kids, what I'm getting? Yeah, with this, because uh, of starfisher. Now, it could be a pie that abandoned y'all that could be coming back. We got the empress, okay, for you guys. So they want you guys to receive beauty and abundance. So you may be learning it's a lot of money in the beauty beauty industry. I got my beauty name, okay? Mm, I'm ready for my products. Ready for my close-up. All right, we got here Acorn, the Ace of Acorn. All right. So the advice is that you guys are got a glow up or a blow up coming through right now for y'all as well. And we got here creative force and confidence, okay? Ace of Wands, okay, with the Wheel of Fortune at the bottom, okay? Okay, so a lot of tentacles or a lot of hands or many hands make light work, okay, with uh, this octopus and the starfish. <laughs> and they underneath the water, so you got to go deeper, okay? Or something that's really deep or deep sea diving or somebody likes to scuba do or you guys may be taking class on that or float, okay? Float on. <laughs> Y'all can have somebody flown on cloud nine too, okay? <laughs> I got a whole bunch of shit coming out of this with y'all. Uh, teardrops, great personal sorrows. So it could be sad. All right, so some teardrops here. I don't know who this is. This Eight of Cups Tower, could you leave it, okay? Or you may be dropping a bomb. We got here uh, love, okay? So love is in the air with the lover's card. You guys may be being a significant person or a chance encounter. We got July could be a Cancer or uh, a Leo that you're fucking with. And we got apple, okay? Temptation will test you, okay? Johnny Apple says it's a snake here, okay? Which, and I feel like this temptation is sex, okay? Especially with the lovers being you guys caught in very attraction and that apple with that snake in there. And, you know, they say that the, the, the snake was the dick or something, whatever. I'm going to get y'all advice card or the, or the uh, punani. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I ain't got no time for this. Okay, that's be a dose in here. So that's a temptation sexually, okay? So somebody got some good. It could be a Libra, a Taurus, okay? Leo, God, they said go outside, Gemini, okay? <laughs> I want to go outside in the rain. It's time to go outside, tune into the powerful piece of nature. Wherever you are, feel that one with your habitat, okay? <laughs> All right. So anyway, so somebody could be asked you to come outside and play or somebody wants to get close to you. Yeah, the world card fulfillment and celebration. All right. So this could be somebody you meet on the web and there you go. All right. So you could get a lot of likes or you got a, a, a boost of popularity coming. Gemini cancer. We got here the eight of shells. Okay, so you got so somebody's coming back around Pisces or somebody's coming back around. Um, somebody feel like you abandoned them as well. I feel like somebody want to take you out to eat seafood or um, shrimp or something. <laughs> Let's see what else is going on. So it could be the kid's father coming back around. All right, we got here the eight of crystals. Okay, so collaboration and productivity. Uh, Sagittarius or yeah, worker bees. So I feel like you guys are going to be working a lot or it's, it's a buzz around your name or what you're doing. Okay. That's the three. That's the three of um, pentacles. What I'm talking about. All right. So it could be a Capricorn. This is about a work project. All right. But I got that infinite signal. So it could be a Leo that want to work with you. All right. We got here the four of acorn. All right. Comfort and community. So um, yeah, the four, the four of one. So somebody wants to come to your home. Or somebody like what you're doing or something is very comfortable at your house or somebody feel welcome. You know, the three of ones, 33. So I feel like something is growing here. Okay. Are you in a gated community? Foresight and exploration. Are you exploring your um, hometown or where you live, your neighborhood? Six of shells, sentiment and joy. All right. So six of cups. Okay. So it could be a Scorpio that wants to reconnect with you or something make you feel nostalgic or some of you guys are traveling back home. 
for the full car. Also, sensitivity, okay, alert, pay attention to your surrounding soul searching and reevaluation. So it could be somebody like searching their souls or trying to figure out why did they let you go? Why did they abandon you? Or are you going to come back? Okay, soul searching, okay. Four of cups. Oh, damn, Cancer. What's going on here? We got a parrot. <laughs> a parakeet. All right, now, a pair of keys. Somebody could have a pair of keys to your house, Cancer. All right, now, but it's period. Someone will be gossiping all about your secrets, okay? Oh, my God. Polly want a cracker? Tell me more. Somebody getting paid to gossip about you, okay? XOXO, the gossip line. We got vultures, okay? Uh -uh. Depression, anxiety, worried that somebody's against you, okay? What we got here, vultures? We got wealth, okay? A lot of money. And then we got the bear. Something about cash, money, and, and rumors, okay? We got dangers, especially in money matters. I don't see no money here. I see a collaboration that they may want you to be reconsidered, okay? A group that you may want to reconsider and bide your time and look forward to, like, next week of every season, okay? Three of ones looking forward because it could be, like, somebody, like, getting, um, I was about to say, getting your name, okay? It's that game. Is it called the virus or what is it called? Let me see. It's a Sagittarius that you need to think about, okay? Balance, harmony, insight, and focus, okay? Um, temperatures with the two of ones that just came out. So you're making the right decision, tree wisdom. Like, you already know what to do here. All right, the tree dry will um, help you navigate through the current situation. Her flute can reveal insight and answers to... Uh, answers to the sound it makes okay <laughs> all right so it's something that you need to listen to or you need to hear or it's something in music okay that you need to pay attention to it's almost like the wind okay uh so it could be very windy okay maybe it's um a compass or um the way you pointing so it's a direction i'm getting compass okay direction don't get lost I'm trying to figure that thing out. I got like a survival bracelet. All right. So follow your tour. Leo. All right. We got the two of acorns showing up. So uh, Aries coming towards you guys or a choice or a decision. Insight and focus. Or you guys are focusing on your career or focusing on a business. or what you need to do to execute something. All right. A relationship. We got the 10 of feathers. Okay. Recovery and transformation. Gemini energy, okay. So you could be recovering from some type of snake or some type of poison or some type of um, stomach virus here. But uh, the ten of feather, ten of swords, okay, coming towards you. So something ends abruptly, but it's a snake there. All right, we got here the six of crystals. So yeah, synergy. <laughs> All right, and we have gratitude. All right, so I feel like patronage. Somebody could be patronizing you. It could be a tourist, or you guys are paying something off. It could be for your kids. We got unexpected, the Ten of Crystals, Ten of Pentacles. So you go from the Six of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles unexpectedly. So you flipping your money. All right. We got here the transformation, okay? Uh, Scorpio death ending, okay? Liberation. And we got here the Six, the six of Acorn. The six of, so we got 66. All right. Six of, uh, six of Pentacles and the Six of Wands. All right, success and trumpet. So yeah, this money is gonna make you really happy. It's the hey, um, but I feel like too the outcome is success here. So it's like something in abruptly and bring you a lot of money. Okay. Oh, we got the scales, rainbow, and what else we got here? Hey, you guys, victory. You got that too. Victory, successful day today, Friday. Um, and some endeavor, we have the box, okay, Pandora's box. Now, let's say some of you guys got a gift or so, an heirloom or something and very important. You'll be receiving a gift. We got rainbow for you guys, okay? I heard tattoo for some of y'all, too. Um, the most difficult part of the situation is over as well. A piercing, I'm hearing, too. Um, we have scales. Keep your life in balance as well. Ten of swords could represent piercing. Maybe just get two piercings on your ear. I got, like, one, two, three, four, five, six. I just wear one set of earrings and stuff. I got a lot of piercings in my ear. <laughs> I just don't wear them. <laughs> yeah, but the rainbow also a sign of a promise being kept. Pisces energy, too. All right, so something that you were promised. I was thinking I need to get my tattoo, okay? 
but I ain't getting no tattoo. I keep thinking about what can I get. All right, I'm a little cheap, but short is pop. All right, what's your advice to y'all today? Oh, life energy. Okay, look in the book. Okay, so I feel like you know something intuitively, um, right here. So yeah, you're gonna be like a force to be reckoned with as well. Hey, how y'all doing? Happy fairies of sunshine brings a lot of life um, giving energy. She reminds you to shine your light and to reveal anything in the shadow that needs to be healed. Okay, so you bringing this shit here. <laughs> hey, Miss Ross. Hey, Miss Thomas. I F O. How you doing? You go, Leo. Life energy. There you go. Life of the party. So, anyways, if it's any scene that's hen or any shadow shit going on around you, you'd be the best person to expose they asses. So, I feel like you could be like being on a detective here or something. What did we get here? The box. Okay, yeah. Gifts. Your gifts are being unfolded or your gifts are coming to life in sacral portal. I had just learned something new yesterday too from a client of mine. She was a Capricorn. You know how they say you don't get information from books, you get it from people. Pretty cool too. All right now. That was Leo. So let me let me stay on track. Okay, Virgo. Okay, damn. 10 10. Okay, so you could be saying 10 10 11 11. Okay. I feel like you're starting over. Okay. From ground zero. It could be a good thing though. You could be ending a lot of shit with family and friends or dropping the fucking stressful job here. <laughs> or a person. We got here the four crystals for okay. So comfort and security. A Capricorn, okay. We so <laughs> somebody trying to weasel their asses back into your life, okay. Or this is a beaver, okay, buck tooth and <laughs> the sun card. Uh, some of y'all could be getting the fix. Okay, so why I feel like somebody roasting? Okay, you ain't got no money. <laughs> Marcus, we got the sun card vitality. <laughs> Enjoy at the bottom. All right, we got here the high priestess. Okay, yeah, intuition and scarce knowledge. Yeah, you know something about something. Okay, two. All right, so some type of knowledge is coming to your trust your intuition today. We got the Knight of Crystals, okay, endurance and determination. This could be about your finances and um, putting things to play. So it's all about timing. We got here Page of Crystal, ideals and discipline. Yes, yeah, something you've been calculating, planning, adding some shit up. We got here the Eight of Crystals, okay, uh, dedication, discipline, determination, and progress. Wow. I triple threat, triple D, and we got justice, okay? Well, I feel like I knew y'all was going to get justice. Sorry. Something is coming to you guys that y'all need to know about, okay? This could be legally or just karmic justice. I do feel like somebody is giving you guys something, okay? Apology. Or you guys are building up a really nice neck, as, okay? Uh, egg nest. <laughs> All right, let's see what else is going on. I know uh, yoke, Okay. Feeling tied down or frustrated with your life or something here. We got here a uh, career. We got a woman dealing with a relationship with a woman. And we got here a broom. And we got the club. Damn, who the hell is this? All right, so somebody is trying to make you do something against your will. Or somebody wants you to do something against your will. Or somebody is trying to, like, force your hand to join into something that you don't want to join into. <laughs> we have here a dog far away. A distant friend is thinking of you. Okay, go far away. We got new home, new attitude. So some of you guys are like cleaning up or need to sage your house, sage your damn energy or from somebody. Uh, so somebody could be projecting your ass, dealing with a yeah, career, your career is at work. I feel like, you know, get the fuck off my back is what I heard, like leave me alone. So somebody could be micromanaging your ass, okay, or feel that way. All right, let's see. What's the unexpected here? The page of one, so you have good news coming in, Virgo, unexpectedly, or your ideal is well received. Let's see here, wish wisely. So it could be a fire sign unexpectedly reaching out to you, saying something to you. They got an ideal, they want to work with you as well. And they trying to force the issue, like, I don't want to work with your ass. <laughs> All right, we got lost and found. Okay, what, what? Was once lost is about to be found thanks to the lost and found fairy. Sometimes she can help us find things that we never realized we lost, like ourselves. Okay. Our, you know, dignity, pride. Okay. So lost and found, you can actually be finding something. You may even stumble across a cat, Siamese cat, Siamese twin, or you may discover your twin today, or you may realize that 
that you are, mm, you may have had a twin. Maybe you didn't know. Maybe the twin died. I'm getting a whole bunch of other shit going on here. But she's like um, pouring water or water is being spilled here. So something needs to be renewed, okay, or refresh. Yeah. So some of y'all may have thought you lost the page. You know how you be surfing the internet. I do it all the time. And all of a sudden, you're like, damn, I lost that page. And you go back in there, and you're able to relocate a page that you thought was shut down. Some shit like that could also happen, right? You thought you lost all your work, and you still you find it, okay? Something that was important to you, though. All right, so Libra, what's going on for y'all today? <laughs> We got here page of feathers. Okay, so somebody nosy as hell. All right, I feel like somebody's digging in your trash can with this raccoon. You know how they be eating the trash out the um, garbage and shit. Or somebody's a piece of shit. That's how you feel about this uh, air sign or somebody else or somebody is saying something. Okay, to get a reaction out of you. So I feel like somebody's gonna say something just to see how you're gonna respond today, uh, Lee, with the page of source, exploration, discovery. You're gonna discover something about somebody as well um, that they were looking or prying for information about you, or they are today, okay? Five of shells, okay? Hope and readjustment. So this is five of cups. This could be a water sign that's going to say they sorry, they still love you, but I feel like you're having a light bulb moment about whoever this person is, okay? They probably like to piss you off or they like when you cuss their asses out. Let's see here. Three of eight. I don't know. Somebody's like enticing a reaction out of you or they want a reaction out of you. Uh, three of ones, foresight, inspiration, Aries energy. Okay. So some of you guys are going to be collaborating with somebody or something that you order could be coming towards you guys. We got the five of swords. Yeah. Somebody jealous of you, Libra. All right. So what's this? The Amadilla. We got dragonflies and shit. Okay. Giraffe. These could be certain things. I look at the spiritual meaning to get more into it. All right, but strategy and resilience. So I feel like a strategy that you're doing is working as well. Because I don't know, somebody, uh, somebody don't like when you're silent or somebody um, like, I hate silence. Three of feathers, okay, release and recovery. A lot of uh, source energy coming through here. So I feel like somebody's having a hard time releasing you, recovering from this. All right, I feel like somebody wants you to be crying over them, but your advice is to release them. The three of swords is your energy, and you are, you're you're going to be recovering from something. And then we got here, the two of feathers, that's your energy too. All right, decision and direction, and the seven of cups, okay? So ambitions and goals, where you want to go to, all right? We got here teardrops, bear, wealth, and who is this? this? Was this cancer shit? Hold on. I'm going to get some more cards for y'all. I thought that was cancer or somebody. Yeah. So y'all could be dealing with a cancer. So either y'all spreading information about them or they spreading information about y'all. Uh -huh. We got fan, romance, celebrity, and cancer got gossip. Okay. So somebody in your neighborhood could be gossiping about your ass or your home and stuff. And somebody could be like instigating and fanning the fuel, fanning the fire. Like, yeah, keep going on, huh? And I know she was over here too. Mm -hmm, this last week, like somebody's messy, and somebody's like and rapturing you in some bullshit. Buying, yeah, speaking up here, seek out information that will help you. Page of source, something that you didn't know you will know. Bridge, successfully overcoming your problems as well. All right, so crossing the bridge or crossing over. We got here exciting event. <laughs> we got June. Let me get one more card. Oh my God. So it could be, a, it definitely could be a Gemini too or a Cancer here. This is on social media. Valley, deep personal strength and peace that ensures success. So I feel like somebody wants you not to feel successful. All right. But your angels got your back. And we got here the wedge. So it's somebody here trying to cause some type of wedge between you and somebody or something that you want. All right. Cheesecake. Okay. So this person could be from New York. Okay. <laughs> that was just random right there or this person like is in a big city or something or maybe you guys want to travel to a big city and pursue your culinary skills with the cheesecake thing and somebody like oh are you sure you're going to be able to do that shit like somebody's like speaking down on what the hell your dreams is and where you want to go to all right personal or you want to be with somebody too all right, manifestation in a magical doorway. So, yeah, it's a door or it's an opportunity that's presented itself probably within the next week or for you guys to do something. 
or somebody is a Debbie Downer, okay, or some shit. We got flourish, okay. The lotus flower of the fairy tells you to learn from the experience and share your inner, inner light on any unclear area of your life and those are others. So I feel like you give great advice, okay. You help people flourish. You're very lucky. It's uh, very prosperous in this picture right here. So I feel like something is going to grow quick, okay. I'm getting like rainforest type of energy, okay. A lot of wildlife shit going on here. Some shit that's made for TV. <laughs> All right, so some of y'all could be growing something, okay? I got that to flourish, okay? Or you will see something flourish very well, or you may start to see it flourish today. All right, so Scorpio, what's going on? I'm seeing a porcupine, okay? So I feel like so you got your shields up or somebody like poking at you. Maybe that's about to be stung or something. Let's see here. Was it the bobcat or sometime was it a a hyena that died from fucking with a po uh a porcupine? Okay, couldn't live. Okay, fuck this stuff up or some shit. <laughs> we got here the ten of pentacles. Okay, so stability and attainment. Yeah, don't fuck with you or something. We got transformation. All right, some of y'all may hear of a will or money for somebody passing, transition and liberation, okay? I also feel like it's a lot of money that's coming in for y'all, or y'all should be making a lot of money where it's going to liberate you from poverty or, or being in any type of situation because the Ten of Pentacles in death with y'all energy. We got here, is this a hedge? Yeah, this could be a funding, like a crowdfunding or um, some type of huge investment. Uh, Queen of Crystals, Queen of Pentacles here, comfort and prosperity. Could be a person that want to talk to you. They want long term with you guys, or someone sees you as marriage material and something that's going to change all the way around. Three of Crystal, collaboration and productivity. All right, Pentacles. We got here Eight of Acorns. Okay, energy and results. Okay. Mm -hmm. Electric ill, so I feel like somebody be careful about being electric. I think I almost got electrocuted this morning and stuff, but I've been shocked and electrocuted several times in my life. I think it's my Uranus placement. Oh, we so, but I feel like something is moving quick, okay, with the eight of ones here. It could be a uh, Sagittarius that you know, I feel like somebody is like um coveting something of yours or trying to covet your money. Hey, Mr. Man, we got here a strength card, okay. So, yeah, they want you not to forget something. Elephant, never forget. Elephant is very wide, and the elephant protects its young. And I do believe, if I was watching correctly, when a crocodile or a, is it one of them, uh, either a crocodile or a alligator, when they sense danger around their kids, they throw their kids in their mouth, okay? Six of shells at the bottom, okay? That's how they were showing how the uh, different animals and animal kingdom protects their young from danger. And I believe crocodiles do put their kids in their mouth. <laughs> so the um, and to danger was clear to the Ten of Pentacles. OK, so I don't know what that means to y'all. Go look it up. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Thank you. I was halfway doing some stuff. Courage and endurance. OK, so I feel like you are setting something up or if somebody is transitioning, they set something up for you, Scorpio, to be fine. A mother with the Queen of Pentacles, uh, grandmother, father, somebody here. It could be a Leo with the strength card that left you some type of finances so you could be OK. You may learn that. OK, spirit could be heartbreaking. OK, because you don't have this person. You know, we got the call. Be careful. Don't take no risks. So I feel like somebody is over here. You'll be receiving a gift. Rainbow. We got the scales. We got victory. Keep your life in balance and some endeavor. Broken bridge. So I feel like, too, somebody is about to uh, sever ties or you're about to sever ties with somebody where you guys will never go back to being the same ever again. July and love. Okay, so it could be love coming in your life in July or this could be a lover. Okay. Yeah, we got rainbow. I feel like somebody's trying to uh, either convince you to do something or get you involved in something that you don't really agree with, okay? Yeah, we got the spear. This could have been somebody passing away through heart attack, okay? Sharp pain. Um, also, I feel like somebody is trying to break your heart, okay, Scorpio? Keep your life in balance. Or somebody's trying to make you feel bad. Somebody's trying to also get you involved in something legal. But I feel like you're going to get some type of gift here. The gift is financially to a lot of it as well. So victory in some endeavor and broken bridge. That's that death card. I feel like something is once it's, it's done, it can't be changed. Unsuccessful, um, unsuccessful outcome to a plan or a problem for somebody. All right. So somebody should have thought, thought that through. 
baby. Remember I said protecting your young, okay, new beginning, or your business, okay? Some y'all need to protect your ideals or shit, your money, 401ks, okay? All type of, I'm hearing like though, them um, wealth pe wealthy people where they go to something, okay? Somebody like manager could be taking their money, stealing shit. I always get that because it says somebody trying to do some dirty shit. Look in the book, okay? New beginning, okay? So I feel like somebody is like reading up on something or somebody knows your future and somebody else's future with the baby, okay? And the two doves, like you supposed to have a beginning with somebody. But we got here, look in the book, okay? So you somebody could be looking you up or trying to find you. Also medication, okay? Look in the book for some type of cure with these mushrooms, okay? Or this is enhancement to your spiritual gifts. We got here, whatever your question is right now, you'll find the answers in the book. The words you find will bring insight to see, okay? <laughs> All right, so Ace of Cups, okay? So you could be getting a new love, a renewing love, Sagittarius with somebody, a, a, a Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, okay? All right, so some renewal could be happening. What you got here? The Ace of Feathers, so yeah, reconnection. All right, Mental Clarity Foundation. We got here the Six of Cups, probably a Scorpio that you're going to be reconnecting with. Sentiment, joy. Somebody could be giving you something or doing something really nice. An I, I act of kindness here. What is them things called? Um, otters or stuff? These look like otters here. All right. So foresight and inspiration. So I feel like somebody's been looking. All right. Trying to get a read on you. What's going on? Three of one. We got the nine of shells. Okay. We got gratitude and fulfillment. So you guys going to be happy about something here that you hear? We got the queen of acorn, passion and creativity, okay? So something you've been creating is well received. I feel like you may be partnering up with somebody that shares your same ideals, okay? Awakening, okay? <laughs> this could be your beauty to renewal and enlighten. And we got the nine of pentacles at the bottom, Virgo. Pisces. So unexpected wish coming or unexpected communication or something that you really like, okay, that's going to make you feel good and fulfilled, okay? Nine of Cups, it could be a drink somebody offer y'all. Be careful about how you spend the money and don't buy the bar out or just, you know, keep a handle on your money, okay? Because I feel like you're going to be out there drinking, having fun, but you got a shark or some people around you, all right? Make sure you get your fair share of a deal, too, if you are going into a partnership, all right, what they call it, prenuptial agreements or something, just make sure you look at the fine prints as well. Because I feel like you're reconnecting with somebody or you're reconnecting with a passion and that you don't see that it could be danger around finances. Take care of the review. Material life, but you'll be celebrating, having fun. We got April, okay? So what's that? A, a Aries or a Taurus or April is very significant. We got broken ring. And then we got grace. Parting ways with someone either in romance or business. All right. And time to go out and have fun. So I feel like if you guys just recently separated or um, newly single, I feel like you guys are having a good time. Somebody else may not be. All right. They could be watching. <laughs> All right. Y'all going out to have a little, have a good time. Or somebody else's. You may see this. So y'all got abundance. Yeah, I said pay, pay attention. Somebody could be asking for more than what they want to give. Motivation. So if y'all up there on the karaoke bar or y'all out there having fun and singing, make sure y'all got a lockbox where y'all can put y'all money up, okay? Because she literally got the flower in her hand singing. So I do feel like you guys may be singing and doing a whole bunch of wonderful things or love is in the air. Something is blossoming in your life, Sagittarius. When, uh, when spring approaches, the fl uh, flower fairy urges you to spring into action. Are you eating edibles or smoking? If there's something that you've been re, uh, merely thinking about doing, they say get busy and do it, okay? So I just feel like all of a sudden, you know, you could be sitting somewhere and you're like, okay, I'm about to go do X, Y, and Z, and you just on the go. So they like bring like bring it in. Don't spend it so quick, okay? And, or know what they say, don't spend all one one place, okay? Because <laughs> y'all excited about something. So motivation is returning to your life. Are you guys are motivating somebody else, okay, to love again? And we can learn to love again. Hear me just the reason. <laughs> All right. So you, this person could be trying to give you a lot of reason why you should love them again. All right. So Capricorn, we got the four of Pentacles, comfort and security. All right. So I feel like you guys are comfortable right now. But I feel like you got your eyes on somebody or they got their eyes on you. We have here the Queen of Swords. All right. Perception and truth. It could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. 
So I feel like somebody is watching you at night and bats be blind, okay, or they say. So I feel like somebody's acting like they can't see something or they acting like they don't know what's going on. But I feel like somebody do know what's happening. Somebody does a lot of things at nighttime. Uh, we got here the sun. So I feel like you are the one that knows something, but you act like you're not. Or this Aquarius is, or this Leo. Anyway, so I feel like this light, okay, are you going to be good and vibrant today? Okay, vitality and joy. We got here the five of what? Swords? Damn. Yeah, so y'all dealing with Aquarius strategy and resilience, okay? So five of swords is unexpected. So I feel like somebody is going to do something very low blow, or you done something, or you're going to aim to do something very low to somebody else, okay? Um, we have here two of acorn. I feel like you're still going to make the right decision. Okay, two of ones. You have two choices, insight and focus. And we got here uh, the ace of the page of shell. So I offer intuition and inspiration, okay? So, yeah, I feel like you're very sensitive today around your environment, the people you keep around you, the predators or what you see. I feel like you got eyes in the back of your head today <laughs> or you need to have eyes in the back of your head today. Plenty of material things. We have a tent, temporary situation. We got teapot fly yeah pay attention to your health too or what you eat affairs with the family all right maybe you don't trust somebody cooking or something you may feel like somebody got horrible highs okay or i don't know something is turning you off about something with the fly okay so we got a period of ill health and depression all right that five of swords is somebody sick in the head um envy turns in uh um, admiration turns into envy, which is jealousy, and jealousy is a disease, okay? So somebody definitely looking at you like that with the five of swords unexpectedly. We got bow, okay, plentiful things, okay? So you have a lot to celebrate, or you are celebrating some. Uh, I'm getting fruit flies, okay? You know how um, when you have fruit salt, you got a lot of fruit flies and stuff around something. I'm also getting somebody not um, washing their hands and stuff. Something about something being unsanitized. All right, ask somebody home that you're not too happy with. So you probably don't eat the food or you deciding to like just smoke some trees or do something else and go home. Affairs with your family, okay? So I don't know what's going on here. We got here a journey either physically or mentally that will leave you wiser at the end, okay? So you could be having a trip or I would be careful if you do smoke who you let smoke with you because I'm getting like somebody licensed in. Like, like lacing drugs, saying going on a journey, okay? You're like, what the fuck did I smoke last night? It wasn't just weed or marijuana or something. I'm just getting that. We got teapot or it wasn't just tea and that shit. It was drink, lace, drink, or spike to shit. If y'all weren't all partying um, with that bowl here, or you could be around kids. I'm hearing dare. <laughs> and, you know, I dare you to do this shit, okay? Temporary situation for y'all. All right, you could be talking to the youth, the young people too. Also getting like um, counseling here. Like you gotta be careful what people are doing, but yeah, sanitary issues today. And I believe bats carry diseases and they say a lot of shit came from bats, okay? Some shit like that. Let's, so I feel like you like researching some shit here. Or your intuition right on point. I feel like somebody's gonna make an offer or apology, okay? Page of Cups, Page of Shell. All right, so something in uh, Amadilla, okay, it got a body armor on there. Something about like making, like having protection, personal protection on you. Capricorn, find the balance between your work, rest, and play time, and you have more energy and harmony and productivity in your life. Take a power nap. All right, so if you're not feeling up to going somewhere, doing something, I got Libra energy too. So I feel like you have an open enemy around you, somebody purposely doing something, writing something down to fuck you up, okay? Like they know your secrets or they know what's going on with you. Like somebody's openly attacking you today or doing something to spite you. All right, so Aquarius, let's see what's going on today for you. All right, we got here the love lovers, okay. <laughs> All right, so we got here Gemini, so choice and trust. We got the high priestess, so somebody secretly watching your ass or your lover, okay, intuition, scarce knowledge, right, that you guys know, hermit. So we got Pisces, uh, Gemini, and Virgo, three major... Come. something major is happening or somebody's been trying to keep a major secret from you Aquarius contemplation and wisdom but I feel like you know what's going on or you know why somebody ghosted you or you know so why somebody is hanging back okay hiding yeah 
because <laughs> you like above some shit or over some shit. You got the three of ones unexpectedly. So you may get something, a call, or you may get somebody coming towards you. You got the chariot, cancer energy. All right, so discipline, determination. So I feel like you're determined to get what you want. And we got here the page of crystal, okay? Very beautiful person, the fox. Ideals of discipline, and we got the three of swords release and cover, recovery. So I feel like it's an X here somewhere. It could be a Libra or a Virgo um, that is watching you secretly fall in love, or somebody being nosy about you, what's going on in your life is what I'm seeing. But you're fine. I hear you guys getting an announcement, or somebody's announcing something. All right. <laughs> I feel like after getting fucked up and drunk, somebody may say something. They may have one too many drinks and stuff with the barrel. All right. You feel like something in your life is lap la what they say? Lapsing. <laughs> ah, lacking in your life. Okay. Perhaps love, money, or goals. Okay. I got love here coming towards y'all. We have here great personal pain, teardrops, okay. Y'all may learn somebody the police or something. We got announcements, okay, the bell, okay. The bell of the ball. We got cobweb. Okay, definitely a trap. Somebody was trying to set you guys up. We got here protection from negative forces beyond your control. We got the yoke. Okay, cracked open is what I'm hearing. Okay, feel like somebody can't take it no more. Drunk texting or something. Feeling tied down and frustrated. We got September. Okay, fall. And then we got firecracker. Okay, excitement. Okay, so I feel like. <laughs> All right, so somebody wants you to be shocked or somebody could be being shocked by you, but I don't see anything like that with the high priestess. All right, so I don't know. Act like you know. <laughs> All right, so good news for you. This could be a new car too, okay? Somebody may be pulling up on you and you're like, I knew you had a car. They're like, damn, you ruined the surprise, okay? So I feel like you're about to ruin some type of surprise somebody's trying to do for you because you already know what's going on. <laughs> healing yeah you're like i know your ass is going to come back anyway to heal this relationship or something <laughs> all right so i feel like you have some type of you have somebody pegged um we got here and now it's the time for you to give and receive healing everyone has a natural ability to heal others yes even you aquarius okay so i feel like uh if you are a healer too you can have a lot of people coming towards you to get advice from you so you can have a lot of people showing up so people just like calling you for advice, want to talk to you, hang out with you more than normal. Pisces, last but not least. Uh, hey, Mr. Man. Hey, uh, Miss William. Strength. Okay. Yo. All right. So I feel like you guys are going to something that requires you guys to dress up in costume. All right. We got the elephant here. Some type of good luck is coming in for you guys, okay? Majestic, okay? You could be being honored, courage, and endurance. We have here the shaman. Oh, yeah, Pisces. <laughs> All right, so let's say divine wisdom and spiritual power. You, you're stepping into your spiritual gift, the ego, okay? So, yeah, you see something? <laughs> Both of these birds are the same. The hawk, um... Two of ones, insight and focus, okay? So you focusing on a choice or a person or you have chosen who you want or they have chosen you. All right, we got the nine of acorn, okay? Which is the nine of, uh, what is this? Power and perseverance, okay? Nine of ones, Sagittarius. All right, let's see here. Eight of crystals, okay? Virgo energy, dedication and progression, okay? Crystal, something is crystallizing with a promotion work or something. We got the ace of shells, happiness and abundance. So, and we got the star underneath here. So um, it says peace and healing. Let's see what else is going on. So I feel like you guys have some type of new offer money. All right. Success, love. Okay. I feel like something that requires a lot of patience and endurance from you guys as well. What the hell? Career. <laughs> and June. Some of y'all may see this happen in June if you don't see it now, Pisces. Okay. <sighs> a lot of money. But yeah, so the, you got it. You you have the insight. We have two cards of wisdom showing up for you guys. Yeah. I feel like it's going to dark. Oh, my God. So y'all have somebody that you got to tell no to deliver some bad news, okay? Because we got the club here. Like, how hard? I mean, how many times you got to beat a motherfucker in the head for them to get the point? <laughs> 
for real. Like somebody like living in caveman time All right now. Bam, bam. We got here a dog far away. A different friend is thinking of you. Okay. Someone's trying to make you do something against your will. We got the bag. Okay. Get it, flip it, turn it up. <laughs> All right, so something such as if, um, important as a job or a race. Yeah, the apple, okay? Don't tip, don't be tempted to lower your standards, okay? Give you everything you want, okay? That's coming underneath the club, too. And this uh, Leo Energy, the strength card, okay? I don't know if this is a Leo or a Sagittarius that you don't like. We got the arrow. <laughs> it's poking out. We got here. So you're on the right path regarding some aspect of your life. Scissors, time to cut the cord, okay? Or you will be cutting the cord. And we got a hat. <laughs> I will get this one too. All right. We got bells. Mm -hmm. What's going on with this? All right. So you'll be playing a different role in your life. Okay. And it's going to be bringing you more money. And then we got here the bell. Okay. So a family wish for I'm mean, the wishing well. I said bell. Oh, so some of you guys do made a wish. Okay. They said with a family or something about family is coming true. It's coming true. Okay. The will, a family wish will come true. Something that you want to come to path with your family, or your soul family is coming together with you. You're gonna realize who your family is, Pisces. Solitude, okay. So you be need a lot of peace, or you need some time. Magical blessings, huh? Let's go. All right, we got here celebration and we got journey. Okay, some of y'all gonna pack y'all bags and be heading to the Bahamas of the, the, the Bermuda Triangle. Now, let me quit. <laughs> I need to go out there and get lost in the Bermuda Triangle. Okay, somewhere. <laughs> now, let me start. They were like, where Nisha at? Lost in the um, land. <laughs> We got here, get ready to let your hair down and celebrate. It's time to go out and play. An invitation could be on, yeah, the bell of the ball, okay? So let's see here, pink, okay? Talk to you guys soon. Please drop a like, share, and comment. Bye-bye, Pisces.